Hey everyone! I wanted to do a quick tutorial um, of my one of my favorite eye looks. I love browns. I love golds. But sometimes I want to add just a little pop of color um, to really bring out my blue eyes. So here is something that I like to do. I've already primed. I have primer on my eyes. Remember it's a prime not to prime. And I'm going to be using palette 4 which is a mix of browns, um, there's a little bluish grays, and a navy. Okay. okay, so I'm going to start with Tender, which is a shimmery taupe. And I'm going to put it on my brow bone. And I will go back over and do this too. I'm using my deluxe brush. Okay. Now I'm going to use Secretive, which is a shimmery gold, and I'm actually going to use my Cream Shadow Brush. I'm going to use this because it's more um, compact, and so it really gets, it really holds on to that color. It's a tight, tight brush. So it really makes that gold stand out. I'm going to do that about halfway across my lid. A little more than halfway. Three fourths, I guess. So this is secretive. That little pop of gold. Okay. Next, I am going to use my crease brush and I'm going to use Brave, which is a dark brown. It's a little lighter than Forthright, which is my favorite shade in palette one. Um, so it is lighter, it's not as dark. And I'm going to use it on my outer V and up to my crease. So this is very simple. You can make it as light or dark as you want, so it's good for the day. You could also use it at night, too, if you're going out. And these colors look great on everyone. They're perfect neutrals. Neutrals. So I make like a 7 in that outer V there. I go above my crease, my crease color, just like that, okay? I'm going to get a little more gold here in the inner corner because I want that um, to pop out. Okay, and I'm going to go back with Tender and my Deluxe Brush and buff out those lines. Okay, now... I use, for my liner, I'm going to use this Triumphant, which is a navy color, and I'm going to make it wet. So I'm going to use my rose water, and I spray just a little squirt into my cap, and I get the brush wet, and then I'm going to wipe off any excess color. I used a black yesterday. <laughs> any excess water and color. And then I'm just going to press it in. And line my eye. I love using shadow as a liner. This is the liner shader brush because it makes a more soft line and you can make it vibrant without it being a harsh line. So again, this is triumphant, and this is where my pop of color, my pop of blue is going to come. So I used a gold and a brown and a taupe, and now I'm using a navy blue. That really hurt. <laughs> a navy blue as my liner. And you can make it as thick or as thin as you want. There it is. Let me get down this lash line here. There we go. There. Okay, so now for the bottom, and I take it all the way to the corner. Now for the bottom, you can definitely use Triumphant. 
for it to match. I'm gonna bring it out just a little bit. It makes a little bit of a wing, not much. Just to extend that line a little bit. Now I'm going to use Proper, which is a brown liner, and very gently line my eyes. I don't want a lot. I'm gonna keep it very simple. Okay. See, very simple line. And then I like to use my crease color under my eye. So I'm gonna take my crease brush again, and I use Brave one small dot and I don't go all the way I just do the outside corner to kind of bring those colors together like that okay that is my simple neutral gold eye with a little pop of navy it's great for um, adding that little pop of color is great um, to pizzazz it up a little bit. Thanks guys, let me know if you have questions.